What's up? I'm Andre Wright, and you're hanging with Dre, an entrepreneurial journey of Iowa City. Me and my family chose to live in Iowa City for a number of reasons. One, because of its awesome atmosphere. Two, because of its eccentric culture. And three, because there are plenty of stories just as cool as mine. Today, I'm gonna take you on a journey to discover people just as cool as me. Let's roll. We're meeting with Tyrell Thornton, AKA the Cubist, today in his recording studio, downtown Iowa City. What's, up, What's good, What's good show, bro? man? How you doing, man? Good, I'm feeling good, good man. Yo, we in ESD, man. You gotta play me something hot, we something lit. crazy. I got you. All right, no doubt. So, show man, you lived in Chicago, you lived in New York, and now you live in Iowa City. So Minneapolis. What, Minneapolis. Yep. Uh, what brought you to Iowa City, man? What? what why do you I have mean, the music studio? Why you do what you do in this space? I mean, originally I came to Iowa. I first came to see the rappers first. You know, I, I came to play basketball at Kirkwood. I played okay. ball at Kirkwood. Ball, me and the coach didn't get along. We hated each other. I played there for a year. So my second year, I was like, you know what? I always wanted to make music. I'm done with sports. This is the time. So that's when I started traveling to New York, LA, Miami, just meeting people, working in the studios, yeah. learning my craft, getting a uh, mentor from Bang Out, 50 Cent producer. I work with a lot of people. So when I was living in New York, I really got to see the music industry for what it was. Yeah. And it was just an evil, grimy, it was kind of felt like this ain't what I want to do. So yeah. I was like, you know what? I'm going to go back to Iowa, back to the basics, build a studio, and just start from the ground up. Because a, a, a CEO in New York told me, yeah. he was like, in order for you to really make some noise, he said, it's crowded over here. He said, we want to hear about you from over there, from yeah. the Midwest. From over here, we should hear you making noise over there. You know? Yeah. So I'm like, okay, you're going to hear me then. That was a couple of years ago, so they've been hearing us. Yeah. So now we're just going to really just keep letting them hear us and just take over. That's amazing. So that kind of was a motivation to really come here and build. Because people say it can't be done, but I know it can be done. Bad. Bad. Yes. Now it's who, who like doing, who making some noise that I can mean, help us get this Iowa City music market to a bigger platform in the world? Right. I will say, uh, I mean, we got Jordan Burgett. He just had an event and an album release party a couple days ago. He's super dope. Yeah, I like He Jordan. recorded his whole album here, Mix Master Arrangements. We did everything right here. We got uh, King Doe, super hip hop from Chicago, but he's he been to Iowa City for most of his life. That's he's awesome. super dope. Yeah, he I be like in King Cali, Doe. New York, Atlanta, making moves. Yeah. We got Mario Smith. Yeah. Super, super dope R&B artist. Like, he's one of the guys who started right when I started, way back in the day. He is amazing. I think he can make some noise. There's a lot of talent around here, man. It's a lot of talent. You would be surprised. Like, and they all come here. So I all get to see from them Iowa all. City. They live here in Iowa City. Yeah. Doing I help their thing. groom them. I, I just do what I can to help them do what they got to do. Put them on stage in front of thousands of people when we do events. That's amazing. Yeah. Hey, man, we done kicked it. We done listened to some music. You done told me everything about ESD Studios. Man, let me go bust you on some pool. Let's get man. it. Let's go, Let's, go. Let's, Let's, make go. It Let's make it happen. <laughs> we out. Bam. Yes. Now it's. like the broader music spectrum like what assets do we got that we can bring to the music world that m most people might not even know I mean we got that Midwest vibe like that real soulful Midwest humble vibe in the music like it's real like humbling just kind of like the atmosphere kind of like the weather it's just like just kind of peaceful you know just very relaxing that's what I would say what is your sound? Like, do you got like a, a brand sound or I something? I mean, like my that? sound is definitely 100% hip hop. I mean, it's like a lot of R&B and a couple of different other other influences, but definitely real, just hard hitting hip hop. So you using a lot of MPCs? Mostly MPC, a lot of native instruments, a lot of big sounding instruments is what I use. Like, Dope. So I'm kind of a big guy. So when I hit that machine, it's going to be like, <laughs> boom, boom. You know, so that's just how it is. So, like, the machine is a metaphor for who you are really in life, right? It's kind of just come out like me. Big, strong, aggressive, like, right in your face. 
but also a very cool, laid back, got that vibe, got the soulful vibe to it as well. So everybody can feel it. So if I was someone coming out of state and I want to come in this market and I want to create a studio, what asset, what things would I need to be successful in Iowa City to create my own like I mean, my studio, studio is successful more. It's not even really because of the music. Of course, the music is good. My mixing, my engineering is good, but people kind of gravitate towards me. They like working with me. Power's in the people. Exactly. You heard it. You got to have the right people to build a community, to build entrepreneurship. You got to have the right people. That's why we're sitting here hanging with Tyro. Oh, how do the artists make money here? Like, what, what's, the, what's, the, what's the ecosystem like for uh, hip hop? hip hop music in Iowa City? What's the ecosystem? I mean, it's not a lot of money being made. I'm just be real. Like, as far as the music, it's other things like the concert promotions, like okay. videography and running a studio besides actually being an artist. It's like a lot of different things you got to do to make the money. So do you so see a lot of that happening with some of the artists here? A lot with of the that happening here, like a lot of people modeling, yeah. people traveling, doing what they do, people yeah. doing everything. Like, Couple of my guys in Minneapolis, they in reality shows and yeah. you no know, people just doing their thing, man. So sooner or later it's gonna happen in Iowa City. Like something's gonna happen. That's I, I think I'm gonna be the person that's gonna be behind it. Man, you heard it here first. Holla at your boy. That's Tyrell. I'm Andre. You hanging with Drake.